Hey everyone, Star Knight here. For today's video, we're gonna be drawing He Sung in a BYS concept. Since their BYS event is getting near, I decided to draw something related to that concept. And since by the time I uploaded this video, I have already drawn Sano, Jungwon, Sunghun, and Nikki. So today we're gonna be drawing He Sung. For this concept, I want him to look fierce and intimidating, and it will also give him a hotness vibe, if you know what I mean. So right now, we're just figuring out the overall shape of the piece. We're just doing some minor adjustments. Hisung's hair gave me a little bit of a hard time. Since I don't usually do clean hairstyle, you're gonna see me struggling later when I started putting my grayscale colors. Because for some reason, his hair keeps looking like a box on his head. For Hisung's outfit, we just copied the one he had for the BYS trailer. I just added some little twists. I decided to make him hold the lipstick near his lips. This will be one of the main focal points of our piece. I want the piece to look hot and intimidating, that's why I added some of this element. After sketching the piece, we're now adding the grayscale colors. Since we have already figured out what we want the piece to look like, we can move on to put in the shapes. Okay, let's talk more about his song. Both his visuals and vocals are no joke. His voice is so angelic, especially when he does high notes. You're really gonna fall in love with him, especially when he does the stares and the looks. Remember I saw some of his clips from TikTok. I think this is in one of their manifesto tours. He was staring so graciously in one of the fans. I think he also did it in Polaroid Love. This guy knows he looks really gorgeous. And I really love the comments, it's so funny. Like some of them are saying, okay, Hisung's photo card will be sleeping on the couch. Or some of them will keep saying, that should be me. He's just too handsome and gorgeous. That's why while doing this piece, I also had a lot of pressure. So for the drawing, we just kept adding some shadows and some minor adjustments. Doing the hands was surprisingly very easy. Usually it takes me like more than 30 minutes to finish one hand. I was in a really good mood. Here, we're just defining some of the important parts of the face, like the eyes, the nose holes, and the mouth. Since most of my drawing is close to a real-life portrait, I need to make sure that I nail the eyes, which is a lot harder compared to when you have a line art. So with line art, your, your lines have already shown the shades of the character, unlike if you're doing paint style. Right now, I'm just trying to capture the shape of the hair. This is what I mentioned earlier that gave me a hard time. If I hide my sketch layer and it's just the overall shape, it looks like a box. That's why doing the lightings and the shadow for this part was really tough because it's gonna bring the whole shape of the hair. So right now, we're just adjusting the shape of the hair with the liquefying tool. And here, I'm just feeling the shadows and trying to figure out where I can put it. That will help with the form. Since the hair is slicked back, I tried to make the shadows going upward. The goal here is to make the hair look clean and shiny. So I used the blending tool to soften the shadows and then we added the highlights for the hair. After adding the base color of the clothes, we're now adding the soft shadows. The guidelines that I made from sketching was really helpful for this part. 
overall the clothes didn't give me much of a hard time For this part, I started noticing the flaws in the hymn, so I tried adjusting the shadows and the lighting. Also, now we're starting to do the main focal point of our piece, which is the lipstick. This will look so cool later, especially when I add the colors. Now we're adding a dark background to make the piece look more in-depth. I feel like Heesung looks good in any concept that you put in. Whether it be cute or intimidating, he would look good in any concept. Now we're just adding highlights for the lipstick. Keep in mind that when you're doing lighting and shadows, you need to know what type of material you're working on. This will help you figure out how the lighting and the shadows will work on this item. Now we're adjusting the color balance of our piece. This is my favorite part from the whole process. Aside from the color balance, we're also adjusting the brightness and the contrast. I don't want the piece to look very dull, especially with the colors. That's so why for this stage, I play a lot with the setting. For the hair, we also started adding this mini strands. This will add more detail. I want the hair to look natural at the same time, slick and clean. I feel like the colors really complement each other. I intentionally made the lipstick bright red, so most of the viewer's eyes will be looking there. Red is a strong color that really catches the viewer's eyes. That's why whenever I use this type of color, I'm very careful with how the piece would work. Here, I'm trying to fix the lips. I'm just adding a more saturated and darker shadow. I also added some eyeshadow for Hisong. This really gives a good pop for the eyes. I had a lot of fun drawing Hisong's face since I, I get to put more makeup. Like aside from real life, makeup makes your character look more gorgeous. But with makeup or without makeup, Hisong still looks so good. This is the exciting part that I'm talking about earlier. We're adding a lot of red smudge around the lips. I felt like this will make the character look more intimate. And then after adding the red smudge, we're now adding some small highlights. Drawing Heesung today was really exciting and interesting. I really enjoyed putting the details on his face, even though there's a lot of pressure since I'm drawing Heesung, which we all know is so gorgeous. Like, how can you look good in every outfit that you wear? But yeah, I want to wish everyone who will be attending the BYS event of and hyphen good luck. I hope you enjoy the day and the event. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to buy a ticket since I'm saving up for the concert. So yeah, I'm still hoping that I could secure a ticket. For the background, I decided to make it look like a curtain. Then later, we're gonna make it more darker and saturated. But yeah, I want to say it again. Overall, I was very satisfied with the result of the piece. Drawing Heesung was a lot of mixed emotion, a lot of excitement and nervousness. But yeah, I feel very proud of the result. Now we're just adding some final touches of the piece. Then I added this rim of shadow around the character to make it look more intimate and mysterious. Then we added a strong red highlight to complete the overall mood of the piece. We are drawing near the end everyone. Thank you so much for watching until the end of the process. I hope you learned something and enjoyed the whole, the whole drawing and I hope you like it. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Here's a quick speed paint of our piece for today. I just want to say again, thank you so much for watching until the end of the video. Drawing Heaston was really out of my comfort zone since I, ha I had to do a lot of things that I haven't done before. But overall, I was satisfied and I enjoyed the process. For more videos like this, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Thank you so much for watching again and I'll see you next time.